Viral Science, the home of creativity. Hey friends, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you how to make an home automation system which can be controlled with Amazon Echo Dot, Amazon Alexa app, and manual switches. Alexa, turn on device one. Okay. Alexa, turn on device two. Okay. Now follow the circuit diagram if you are using off the shelf components like a channel relay module, ESP32 board, push buttons, IR receiver. But I will be using my personal design PCB for this project. So to order this PCB we have to visit jlcpcb.com. jlcpcb.com is also the sponsor of this project and it provides good quality of PCBs at very cheaper rates. So visit jlcpcb.com, sign in with your ID and click on quote now. Add your Gerber file over here. The links for the Gerber file will be on my blog so you can get these files from there. After uploading this PCB file, select the quantity, how much you want and select the color of your PCB board. After selecting the quantity and color, select on save to cart and place your order. In few days I received my PCBs which were nicely packed inside this box. So now let's open this covering. So as you can see the quality of PCB looks very good. So now we will quickly collect all the components which are required for this PCB. So I have listed them here. and. After getting all this, we will assemble these components on our PCB board and start the soldering process. So now I have soldered all the components on our PCB board and now it's time to connect the ESP32 board on this PCB. As you can see this version of PCB has a very good labeling of all the pins which are connected to relays, switches and other components. So now connect your ESP32 board with your computer and open the code. So first download and add these libraries. Then in this section of the code you have to enter the Wi-Fi name. So in my case I will enter the Wi-Fi name and then enter the Wi-Fi password. Make sure all your devices are connected to this Wi-Fi network. Now here we will add the device name. I have added device 1, device 2, device 3. You can even add other names like room light, studio light, bulb, smart bulb, fan, anything you want. So to control this, we'll call out these names. So enter these names accordingly. So I'll set it to default, which I kept before. That is device 1, 2, 3, 4. And now select the board that is do it esp32 development kit version 1 now select the port and upload the code while uploading the code press the boot button so it will start uploading the code
and here we have done uploading so now we'll connect the power supply so as we are using a 220 volt to 5 volt converter so we will directly give 220 volt to this pin so i'm connecting a two pin in this connector be very careful while doing this because we are using very high voltage on this pcbs and it is uh, completely exposed from the bottom side so do not touch your hands uh, while the connection is live now open your smartphone and connect to your wi-fi network make sure all your devices are connected to same wi-fi network now open the alexa app click on devices on the bottom right now click on add button on the top right now select add device and scroll to the bottom and you will find one options others select the option other and now click on discover devices it will take a minute to discover all your devices so after it find all your devices click on ok and you can add all this device to your group in my case i will add to my bedroom group So now we'll connect a bulb holder, connect one of its end and connect it to the relay plugs. Now I have set up everything on my desk, even I connected the switches to my PCB board and you can see the blue light on ESP32 board, it means the Wi-Fi is connected. Alexa, turn on device 1. Okay. Alexa, turn on device 2. Alexa, turn on bedroom lights. Okay. So friends, Alexa, I hope you like this project. Do hit that like button, share this video lights. with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos and okay. I will see you in the next one. Do subscribe and press bell icon to get instant notification for new video.